Good evening, everyone, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today, we're going to be checking out a brand new game called uh, Carrier Command 2. This game is, game is set to release on August 10th, officially on Steam. They're also offering VR support. Now, as to which are they coming out on console, I'm really not sure. But as I understand about the game is uh, you're going to be taking command of an aircraft carrier set in the future. You get launched from a uh, I, basically the ISS. They do have multiplayer support, so we'll be able to play along today with Raptor, and uh, hopefully it'll be a pretty fun game. Right? So as I understand, like I said, you'll be taking control of islands, you have uh, missiles at your disposal, torpedoes, artillery, and you can also have land vehicles along with aircraft all at your disposal so that you can take control of these islands and take control of their resources. So without further ado, I would jump right into it and then we uh, see you on the other side. Let's start up a new game here and then jump in with Raptor. Oh, cool. Oh, I guess since I already watched it, I don't have to watch it again. Oh really? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm having to do it. Wait, where are you? I'm on the, on the bridge of the ship. Oh, well, I'll be there in a minute after the cutscene. <laughs> I don't see a way to <laughs> skip it. Wait, unless I pause. Oh, I can just click return to bridge. Oh no, okay, it puts me right back to the shuttle. All right, then I gotta wait for the cutscene in the elevator and there, be there by the time the enemy con conquers the whole map. <laughs> Can you see me coming down? Oh, that's actually a curious question. Shoot, hang on. Let me get back up there. Oh, no, come on. I already landed. Hold on. Damn it. Oh, well. You know, when the first time I played this, it was all like ice. Like the planet was snowy or whatever. Yeah. But I'm glad they, they're doing like, um, it kind of reminds me of Subnautica for whatever reason, the map. Like there's small little islands, but mostly it's an ocean. However the hell they got this carrier here, I don't know. <laughs> You'd need a ship bigger than the carrier to transport the carrier. To me, it reminds me of uh, Storms a lot. Oh, absolutely. Like even 100%. the way you run. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the art style. Yeah, all blocky and everything. Cool, I'm down in the vehicle bay. Can you see me going up the elevator? Uh, no. I guess I'm down in the vehicle bay right now. I know, but I'm, I see into the vehicle bay. Hi. I can see the plane sitting there. Oh, hi. There you are. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. We're going to be an officer on deck. Wait, on deck? is... Officer and gentleman, is that the one with Jack Nicholson where he tells him he doesn't, he does not understand the truth, he does not, you do no, not no, you know. can't handle the truth. Yeah. No, that's a uh, a few good men. Oh yeah. This is cool. I guess I'll head back up to the bridge. If we get, I've never seen another character in this game, so I'm wondering what. I saw you on the elevator. There's that, at least. All right, I'm coming up. Uh, back up to the bridge. Yeah. There we go. I'm taking the elevator right now up to the bridge. Oh, really? That's weird. We have spacesuits on. Oh, wow, that's we weird. Do. <laughs> that's weird. They look actually kind of like pilot suits. Yeah, like a pilot meets a uh, <laughs> like an astronaut. Okay, with the whole neck thing going on. But okay, that makes sense since we just came down in shuttles. Oh yeah. All right. right. Let's begin. Activate power breaker. Use helm. 
Use navigation screen. And then deploy carrier. There we go. Well, should that collision thing be <laughs> beeping? <laughs> oh, no. oh, wow. We got a, is that a... It's just a depth sonar. I wonder if we have to fight submarines at some point. That'd be cool. Oh, I, I, I didn't even think about that. That would be kind of dangerous. Yeah, no kidding. I mean, our ship is kind of supposed to be an entire fleet, not just a carrier. So, our it would surprise me. Is... All right, navigate to enemy island. All right. Well, all of our defenses are armed. Precipitation, fog, ocean current, depth, wind, cardiographic. Wow. Yeah, oh, I had more. once. I had one set up for wind, another one for cardiographic, and then the last one was for uh, ocean. That's the way I did it. Okay, so we are. Okay, so there's pretty much enemy islands all around us. Yeah. Oh, if you look at the hollow map, you'll see there's a crap ton of islands. Yeah, the closest one would be to our starboard side. That's right. I guess we'll navigate. Is there a helm lock? Uh, yes. If you look over to the right side of the, uh, oh. of the wheel, you'll see it says, like, heading lock, steering lock. We got headlights. <laughs> Thank you. I got them all turned on right now, dude. Here we walk. Oh, that's nice. Okay. All right, we're bearing 072. Hard to starboard. Yeah, heading lock is like autopilot. Basically. Oh, okay. Maintain heading. How can we calculate distance? can't tell. Is there a way to uh, center the wheel? I guess you turn off steering lock. Yeah, turn off steering lock and back on. heading lock. Yeah, okay. Activate. We got alarm status. Oh, that's cool. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, popcorn's done. Woo! Popcorn. Alright, cool. We still need to turn a bit, but I guess we don't need to run into the island. All right, navigate to enemy island. All right, so the island we're heading to right now is a utility depot. How do you know that? Uh, come over here to the inventory stuff. You can see the inventory and logistics. Of the enemy base? Yeah. So if you oh. go into this uh, inventory screen, you'll see that each one of them has like their own individual kind of thing. Oh, warehouse and a barge. Okay. So the enemy has supplies here? So when oh, we capture cool. that base, it's going to give us certain ah. things. So this could be how we resupply, maybe. Mm -hmm. That's cool. That's what I'm assuming, at least. I, uh, I'm still impressed that there's like a, a ceiling fan in here. Currently, we have 100 flares, 20,000, 20 millimeter, 100, 100 millimeter, 60, 120. Yeah, we got, we got a lot, dude. Oh yeah, so we have uh, cannons, we have aircraft, we have torpedoes, we have cruise missiles, and we've got, uh... oh, pizza rolls already. Ding, yeah, we got pizza rolls. <laughs> oh, so we're heading forward at 15 knots. As long as it's combination, we're good. Oh, yes. Can't sleep in the bed. That's... Zero out of ten, immersion destroyed. <laughs> I still want to be able to see what where I've got... There must be an option to see where the wheel is turned to. Oh, no, it's a... Uh, so if you see down here on the bottom right-hand corner, see where it says side thrusters? That's your... That's technically your rudder. Okay. I'll maintain heading. All right. Island should be ahead of us. Yep. 21 knots. Full speed. It's going to take us a minute to get there. Meantime, let's look around. We've got the uh, anti-aircraft ready. Should we? Do we need to uh, order any of the planes to load up with ammo first? Like, do no. we have to? No. They come preloaded already. Okay. 
And then when so they need to reload, you just recall them back to the carrier. Yeah, I don't remember any of these. Oh, whoa, what the hell? We are listing like crazy. Whoa. I told you they had rogue waves in the game. <laughs> Is that the enemy uh, port to our right there? Did we pass it? No. That's a that's home base. Where we just launched. Oh, okay. We pulled out and went to the the right. Okay. Ooh, what is this? Do we have uh, binoculars? Oh. Is this the football? That is the self-destruct system, yeah. <laughs> oh. All right. Because <laughs> I think there's an achievement for setting that one off. According to Bradford. Uh-uh. <laughs> Don't. I want to live. Arming all systems. Uh... <laughs> So I wonder in this game, like, there's still a lot of things that are unclear to me since I haven't done a full game. Like, what happens when we get destroyed? You know, like, do we just teleport back to base and get another carrier? Can we spend points for it? Or I don't know. We can like, find out right now. <laughs> that, that, that I don't know because I haven't had my carrier destroyed so far. 32 knots. Wow, ima imagine doing a full campaign too, by the way. That's insanity. Right? I mean, we're just one carrier. We I don't think other ships will ever join us. How, how much what's the uh, distance of each of these squares? That's a good question. <laughs> Cuz I know it takes a while to get to an island. I know that much. Oh, we can see wind currents and stuff or is this maybe it's not wind current, maybe it's the ocean current. I wonder if, yeah. if we bypassed all these islands and just went to the enemy island, what would happen? Hmm. Maybe a really nice trophy. I, you know, because I don't know if our ship would ever get... We wouldn't get stronger, would we? We wouldn't get... Well, may, I wonder if we'll get more advanced planes as we go along or better weapons. I think so. Um, those waves. Start you out with very basic stuff. Uh, let me see. I'm just going to take a look at the other islands. There's a barge upgrade, another warehouse, surface chassis, air chassis, fuel. Well, there's one for turrets. Wow, that's crazy how much information they give us and data. That's so good. Very unexpected to see all that. Oh, enemy, uh, I can see the enemy base. I see what looks to be a water tower. And a large light. Oh. Maybe an enemy airfield? Looks like an airport, maybe. And we are going slow. Are we? We're at, oh, 27 knots. Well, against the waves, I suppose. Heading 127. Huh. Yeah, we're full throttle, too. Uh, we're going against the wave or wind. We are. That's why. Wow! Look at this giant wave coming up. This is crazy. Oh no, we're going against the ocean's current. That's why we're going so slow. Oh yeah. I mean, I mean, in retrospect, thirty knots really isn't that slow, but. Now we're down to 25. Want to go see the hangers? Yeah, are we going to stop? Well, we still got a ways before we get to that island. So. Well, don't we want to attack from a distance? We are a carrier. Yeah, but we also got to think about fuel because we're still a long way away in order to send the drones out. Ah, okay. Where's our fuel? Inventory? It's over here. Uh, to the right of you. Okay. Oh, it doesn't give us, like, a precise number. Fuel no. level is just, like, blinky light one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> very, very precise naval terminology. Do we have flashlights? Uh... I don't know there's wall lights, but... I don't think so, actually. I mean, may as well turn everything on. It's not like they're not going to see us. Look at the keyboard Radar. controls. 
there's voice in the game. Um, attachment fire, secondary attachment, attachment primary. But I'm not seeing anything for uh, flashlight. There are light for the hangers? We can't really see anything. Did you already go down? Yeah. I see the plane sitting there. It's very dark, though. Take the elevator. There's a corridor light, but I don't see a light for the... Uh... It's probably up on... Um, if it's in... Oh, my God, that's dark. Well, I'm on the uh, catwalk, but there could be one on the floor. Ah. Uh, vehicle bay light. There we go. There they are. Uh, oh, there we go. I was going to say, if it's anything like a real carrier, then it's going to be on the uh, catwalks. Wow. We got what looks to be like 20 millimeter, maybe 30 millimeter cannons. Those have got to be anti aircraft. Missiles there, yep, there. Lost you. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's the vehicle bay down there. Just below. Very cool. Hello. Can we actually get down to the level of the Um, I haven't found a way to do it. Ah, uh, there's a hatch, but we can't go. Oh, yes, we can. Wow, now we're down to... Wow, this is crazy how detailed this is. I think they did a really good job, huh? Yeah, just like you'd imagine, there's like all sorts of... This is like Star Citizen level of just like putting a bunch of power things around. Oh, wow. Yep, there's tanks down here and drones. They're ready to go. I'm just looking for Med Bay. Oh, you're not feeling good? <laughs> I got seasick. You need a li little Tums? Uh-huh. Oh, I found the kitchen. Ooh. Oh, yeah. That's pizza. This is four instead of deck. Uh-oh. People are going to be mad. Zero out of ten. Unplayable. <laughs> How dare them. It would be cool if they said, uh, instead of numbers, just Whoa. decks. Like uh, vehicle bay, catwalk, bridge. Uh, approaching enemy island. Uh, very orange. I'd love to see a first-person uh, cyberpunk game in this style. Right? Oh, yeah, that is uh, lava right there. All right, we're ready for war, I suppose, huh? So what do we need to do to take this island? Hit the, um... Uh, I'm gonna stop the ship. Hit the radar? Actually, I think we're still a little too far away. Yeah, according to the game, it just tells me to use helm. <laughs> Burning the pizza rolls. <laughs> there is something fun about hitting that button. But this allows for full role play, and that's really cool. <laughs> and with all the seats here, I think we've got, what, two, four, uh, six, eight, maybe nine chairs in here? Oh, man, you could have almost 10, uh -oh. 15 people on the ship. Shooting at Are us they up. shooting at us? Oh, rude. That's what we got to take. Let's take us away a little bit. Yeah, wow, they, they did some pretty good damage. Our whole starboard side got hit pretty good. Yeah, a bit. Right, stop in the ship. I uh, use viewing scope. Viewing scope. Yeah, it's uh, this little thing down here. It's like one of those old school little flip things, you know? Oh, yes. <laughs> that I can't remember what it's called. Control. Uh, I can remember doing this now. Enable stabilization. Observe enemy island and tag visible units. How do you tag? 
All right, repairing the ship. There's a lot of units there. Uh oh, I think a missile just went out. Oh boy. Wait, you have missiles gone down? I guess. Well, I mean, all of our countermeasures are on, so it should be fine when we're in that regard. Oh, you just launched a missile. Oh, <laughs> get wrecked. <laughs> I, I guess I did. Oh, they're shooting at us again. Ugh. Oh, that's so cool. Clean up a little bit further, and then the seals finally for the capturing. Yep. Ooh, actually, wait a minute. I noticed the enemy has captured an island now too. It's yellow. So these all start out somewhat neutral. So if we were playing against one or two other teams, we'd be a race against who could be the capture of the majority of the map. Have that on the side too. Oh, nice. Oh, there's still enemy vehicles. Yeah. 
descend a little lower. Tanks on the way. I wonder if they can actually uh, spawn vehicles from the base. There it is. Way on towards way. Oh, that's so special. Awesome just seeing that carrier off the, <laughs> the off the edge of the island there. Yeah. You coming over? I'm sitting at the uh, thing right now. I I just completely forgotten how to give them commands and such, but it's really cool to see all this stuff unfold. Uh, so if you click, just pull, hover over, click on them, and then drag to where you want them to go. I'm actually going to recall this bear. something but I don't know I'm not sure what it is a1 and a2 yeah those are the scouts all right S1. wow this is gonna be awesome there it is yep yeah I think it looks so sick <laughs> Hopefully we can change it. It'd be cool to change the carrier colors and put a logo on the side, do a little customization. That would be cool. Turn on the runway lights for him. Oh, okay, right. Oh, I love hearing this thing. No catapult. goes. 
Yeah, because now if you wanted to, you could actually take control of that plane. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. How do you do that? Uh, click on him and then say, like, uh... Oh, camera. Camera, yeah. Oh, I see. better control than I do. Hopefully we can use a uh, joystick with that. Oh, that would be sick. Yeah, WASD with the uh, plane is a little rough, but now he's where we need him to be. Well, I'm coming over with a SEAL team to capture the base. Oh, and you can actually see a, a readout of the map, too. So this is called Sanctuary Island, I think. Not Raptorian? Yeah. Well, they will Looks be. like there's actually two <laughs> islands here. Flying over the carrier now. Oh, wow, we have holding patterns, air traffic. Okay. Yeah, that I thought was really cool. That they at least have holding patterns in there. Oh, we need to destroy all surface vehicles then. So there must be more. I recalled the bear and sent out the SEAL team, so. Well, I'll get on the scope and see if there's anything else. Okay. Sounds a bit good. There might be some turrets left over, because I didn't go over by that fuel, like that depot. Don't see any vehicles. SEL is the SEAL team? Yep. They're about to hit the radar dish. Yeah, just deploy the viruses. Oh, nice. But then... We should capture the island shortly. Should. So this game's going to come down to how effectively can you move, operate, deploy, and move on to the next island, essentially. Yeah. It'd be uh -oh. really cool to see two seals, uh, teams of two for aircraft carriers. Uh, I mean, what's going on? There's another vehicle over here on me. Oh, I can see it firing. Yeah, yeah it's a small, looks like a 20 millimeter. Oof. something over here like ASAP we'll take him out because he's currently stopping the download actually no he destroyed the virus dang it guns ready can you lure him over to our side of the island yeah I'll have him chase me so I'm gonna return to ship and reload oh he's definitely taking pop shots at me we have carrier missile, carrier gun, carrier flare, ground artillery, and guided missile. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do this. Go. Let me deploy S8 or S2. S2 is another seal. It is. Alright. Also deploy a walrus. Yeah, they're not coming to this side of the island. I wonder, did our recon pick that up? Uh, doesn't look like it. Oh, 
of an aircraft. Wait, are we losing SEAL teams? Uh, no. I recall the SEAL team. Yeah, they just destroyed the virus. I don't know why I'm saying we lost a SEAL. Yeah, we certainly didn't have that many teams. No. So I recalled the SEAL. SEAL team deployed is way down the beach. No. It shouldn't be at least. I recalled him since that tank was over there. He didn't have any support. So. Um, did you want to deploy the other SEAL? And then I'll just protect you. I mean, we could do that. That way we could work in tandem. I'll get a ground vehicle out. I want to see what this ground looks like. A lot like Stormworks. So what's uh, what the <laughs> S1? Uh, yes. Should be for the other SEAL. And S2 should be back momentarily. Does yeah, S1 through Yeah, S1 through S4 are SEALs. S5, S6 are walruses. S7 and S8 are bears. So the bears are your tanks. Walruses are anti-aircraft, but they can also do damage to like your medium and small vehicles. And then SEALs just deploy it. Now you can alter any of their turrets and stuff that you want before you deploy them. Oh, so we can change our weapons and the vehicles before we deploy. Yep. Same with the loadouts on aircraft, right? Yep. So you can have them with like, uh, like guns, or you can have them with missiles, bombs. Where did that little turret go? Does the SEAL team have guns? The, no. Uh, vehicle? No. No, you have to rely on the walrus or the bear. Yeah, I'm out here looking for him right now. Well, I assume he'll be back once we hit the uh, once we hit the building. Yeah. Okay, I'm on my way now. I do have a turret on the sealed vehicle. I see it. It's like a 20 millimeter. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Or a 30 millimeter. Oh, Bam. yeah. You're yeah, right. it's a 30 millimeter cannon. Huh. I didn't know that. Well, we've learned. Maybe that was just a different, a different loadout that I had on the other one. Then. Maybe. Is this a seal? It should be. Uh, oh, no, that's a walrus. Oh, I thought I clicked on seal. That's a walrus. So the, you're driving. Oh, that's an anti-aircraft vehicle. Yep. That I guess yours is up. yours is mounted. I think with a 20 millimeter. Or 30. 30. Yep. Well, let's look around for this guy. This is astounding. The fact that we get these types of vehicles is really cool. In the meantime, we can command the carrier. We can command the aircraft. Ooh, lightning. Okay, well, let's get a seal up here then. Hey, connection lost. It wasn't destroyed, was it? Nope. Okay. Alrighty. And you're deploying a seal? I know, but we should do that.
we still have the the scout out? Uh, yes. Oh wait, it, the one you were using said it was a seal. Yeah, it does say seal. What the? Okay, can I command it to capture? No, because you need the viruses. But maybe this one is. Okay, so the v the vehicle is called a SEAL, but it's not like a SEAL team, like infantry that goes out. So it must be a SEAL that's de designated to do that. The Walrus then is just like a larger vehicle that has anti-aircraft, and the Bear is like a big boy. It's like a tank. Let's get another... Do we, what other SEAL do we have that has the virus? Um, currently getting it loaded right now. Cool. But it will be S2. And you're deploying... What is that thing? That's one thing. Uh, what uh, you're deploying? A bomber. Oh, it's a bomber. Oh, cool. Reminds me of uh, Command and Conquer Generals. See, yeah, that, I think... Bomber. That's what I think is. And they're currently reloading one of the bear that I was using. Um, if you want to deploy S2, viruses are ready. Okay, deploying S2. And then just in case, I want to load out another one with uh, viruses, just in case. So S4 is going to be our standby vehicle for viruses. Headlights. Oops. <laughs> uh, for the ship? Uh, for our vehicles. Uh, that I don't know. I haven't tried that yet. Whoa. I, I kind of just sunk the bomber. Oh, did our bomber die? What happened? Yeah. Were, you, were you flying manually? Yeah. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah, it happens. Wait, we're there's... learning. Are those two targets up in there on the beach, or are those ours? Uh, well, I mean, I just landed on the beach. And I'm heading straight to the radar dish. Alright, well, I'm gonna take control of that walrus just in case. Where did you see for headlights? I just see them on my vehicle. Let's see. I think we're going to do this auto so that way. Well, I don't think it'll do it automatically unless you tell it to target that. Yeah, that's what I'm going to try. How do I get it to do that? Um, <clears throat> so you have to like basically drag from that seal to the radar dish. Oh, okay. And then it should automatically do it. it. Should. Otherwise, you can do it manually, and when you do it manually, you just left click and it'll deploy the viruses. Even like it's doing it now. Yeah, I'm watching it. I got that external camera before. It must have been the one on the gun. Automatic mode now. Wow, automatic is very slow. 
Okay. Where's he going? I have no idea. Alright, I'm gonna take control. We just shoot at the tower? Yeah, you can just deploy it anywhere around the tower because it's got a really like, pretty good range. There you go. Oh, they're, they're, they latched up? So you should be seeing a progress bar over on your left hand side of your screen now. Oh, they're like little transmitters. Mm -hmm. Progress bar on the left screen. Yep, I see that. So we're 12%. Okay, so we just got to defend these two. Yep. So if you want to take some long ass time. If you want to hop in that other walrus. All right, I'm switching to the walrus. Or not walrus, the other seal that you have here on the beach. Oh, there we go. Out there? Where's he at? to this island and already like deploying weapons. And we're almost capped. Uh, I'm gonna recall the other seal. I can come back and reload. Oh, the virus one? Yeah. Okay. We can't pick those viruses up. Maybe we can, but probably not. All right, the island is ours. Oh, does it appear to be? Yeah, it's blue. Island on. captured, yep. Sanctuary Utility Island has been captured. Good work. Ooh. All right. Blueprint unlocked. Oh, we have a blueprint pulled. Uh-oh. We have a sonic pulse generator. So that's how, that's the reason why you capture islands, is to get better tech to eventually probably have a final battle with the enemy carrier. That'd be sweet. Once their carrier is destroyed, it kind of is an auto win at that point because there'd be, you'd just at your own leisure be able to capture all the islands. They've already captured their third island. Well, second to be technical. That's not bad. Very good. All right, now with a full crew and with more understanding of this, more practice and more deployment of mission after mission, we'll, be, we'll, we'll gain experience and be able to use that in things like launching the aircraft missiles and all the weapons and of course having someone at the helm we could possibly you know continuously be moving around the island uh -huh. lots of stuff so let's see two four five six seven eight nine yeah like ten ten people per carrier it would be insane <laughs> that would be so cool to have a ten person ship ready to go i feel like i need a cup of coffee you know to stand around <laughs> just have people going on straight main runs other people on anti-aircrafts yeah, I mean, some of these jobs are a little not as important, like vehicle loadouts, you can check from time to time, or damage reports, but it would be cool to see a full ship. I can't wait to do it. All, All right, right, good job, Colt. Mission complete. We'll come back for a live stream on this and get a little bit more experience with more hands on deck, and with more experience, we'll be able to uh, do this more effectively. Good work. Colt also has a channel if you guys want to subscribe to it. Links down below in the description of the comment section, I suppose. Excellent work, Colt. Thank you, thank you. You as Let's well. Let's play this again soon. Thanks. Awesome. Mission accomplished. Let's go have pizza. Mm. Let's go capture a pizza. And a pony. <laughs> yeah, combination. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed this early access look to Command Carrier Command 2. It will be coming out on August 10th. I look forward to seeing you guys there. Please check out and like and subscribe.
for more content. Have a good one.